Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I just came, got home from work, came back from a nine hour shift, and I decided that I was gonna do the new YouTubers tag. I know I look rough, but understand I just came back from a nine hour shift, okay? Anyways, let me pull this tag up. Okay, so the first question is, what is your name? My name is Shate. Where are you from? I'm from Jamaica. I came here when I was 11. And then I migrated to England, Cambridge, UK, when I was 18. And then I came back to America when I was about 22. <clears throat> so 18, 19, 20, 20. That was about four years. Um, how tall are you? I am five foot one. I know I'm so short. How many siblings do you have? Okay. <laughs> okay, so on my mom's side, it's me, my two sisters, and my two brothers. On my father's side, oh my god. On my father's side, it's me. I think my dad has around eight or nine kids. I think. If I'm not mistaken, he has around eight or nine kids, and my mom has four. Okay, um, is this your first channel? In a way, well, it is, but, okay, so when I was younger, I was always doing YouTube. When I was younger, I used to do, like, a couple of videos of me, dan like, me and my friends joking around and dancing, or when I, whenever I went to Jamaica, I would always like record a skit, but those were so embarrassing, so I took them down. But that was like on my other channel, and then this channel was actually a newer channel from those channels. I think I had two other channels, but like I was so embarrassed of all those things that I had on there that I took because I was young and I was like fascinated with YouTube since I was young. So I have like so many crazy <laughs> videos. I hope nobody. Um. So the next question is, what is your channel about? So my channel is definitely going to be about makeup, about beating your face. <laughs> but then it's also going to be a get ready with me channel. So I'm going to have videos with you guys getting ready with me. I do my hair a lot. Does it probably doesn't seem like it right now because my hair is a mess, but I haven't had time. But I'm also going to have like hair reviews. I'm gonna have hauls, fashion hauls. Um, whenever I buy stuff and I buy a lot of stuff, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys like gratis hauls, like all the stuff that I got from my job. Yeah, and I'll probably have chit little chit chat videos about like different shows that I'm watching. Um, what else? So like, yeah, it's gonna be a little bit of mix, a little mixture of everything, but it's mostly beauty and and like girls, like it's like girl stuff well girl or guy but it's like you know a little advice thingy <laughs> why should anyone subscribe to your channel I just feel like that's a weird question why should someone subscribe to my channel I subscribe to people channel if they make me laugh if they're saying like real things that I like I don't feel like I should tell someone the reason why they should subscribe to my channel. I feel like you should watch my videos and if you feel like you like me or if you feel like you want to vibe with me or if you feel like you want to see my growth, then you should subscribe to my channel. But I don't want to feel like I'm force feeding someone to subscribe to my channel. Sorry, if that makes sense. Um, where do you see yourself and your YouTube channel in five years? Hmm, in five years, I'm going to have a bet I'm playing. <laughs> um, in five years, I hopefully, I have started my own business. That's like my personal, that's what I want to do. But with YouTube, hopefully in five years, like I have a million or more, like five million subscribers, hopefully, maybe. Next question was, what inspired you to start making videos? Okay, so, I was in, when I was living in England, I was very bored with my life. 
I had nothing to do. I hardly had any friends except for Amber and Kim, which was like work friends who always go out and stuff. But like, I felt like I was always bored and I, I don't know, I was always bored and I was always watching YouTube. And then I was like, you know what? Let me try going on YouTube and taking this thing serious this time and whatever, whatever. So I was like, okay. And then I bought a camera because I don't like to do anything unless everything is perfect. This is why right now I'm having like crazy like anxiety because I know I look crazy right now. But I this is a quick video. Don't judge me. But yeah. Um, I was born in England. I was like, I want to try this. And plus, I love to teach. So I was like, let me do this so I could teach people how to do what I know how to do and see what that brings. Who are some of your favorite YouTubers? Latoya Forever, Aaliyah J, Jayla Corian, Jayla Corian, Raven Elise. It's my Ray Ray. She's my favorite YouTuber too. Um, oh, how can I forget? Patricia Bright. And I really like Jamie and Nikki. They're so inspiring. <laughs> oh my god, my double chin. <laughs> what does your username mean? Um, my username, well, Shantae is my real name as everyone might already know and the last name isn't really my name but it's inspired I was gonna use Shantae Monet but then when I was doing that someone already had that name so I was like hmm let me try to be unique what rhymes with Moray that what Monet that can still be cute and I was like oh Moray <laughs> So then that's when I chose Shantae Murray and I actually really like it. The best thing about YouTube. You can grow. That's one of the best thing about YouTube. You get to meet so many wonderful people. You get to, um, what's that, socialize. You get to get ideas, like, YouTube is so inspiring. Like, I can never be bored at home because I know I got YouTube. Or anywhere in this world. If I got my phone or I got my TV, I know I got YouTube. So I know I'm not going to be bored because I can literally watch anything. And you could go to YouTube to literally find how to do anything. I remember I was getting fixed in my Alex drawers. And I was like reading, I don't know, I'm retarded or something. I was reading my, <laughs> I was reading the instructions like, what? are they talking about and then I was like you know what let me YouTube this I YouTubed it and I got it right away I was looking at that paper and it took me hours like if I had if I had if I was looking at that paper I would still be like trying to figure out how to make that drawer now and that was like six months ago so YouTube is very handy first thing about YouTube um, there's not really any worst thing about YouTube. I would just say, like, all the drama about with all the, um, some of the channels. Like, they're, I feel like they're unnecessary drama. And then the trolls, like, the trolls are annoying. Like, I guess y'all know my life more than I know my life. Or I guess y'all know everybody else's life more than they know their life. What are your goals when it comes to YouTube? I want to get to at least a million subscribers <laughs> okay my cousin always told me one of his saying that he always says that now i keep saying is i am what i will to be so if you if you basically if you put something out there that's what you that's what you will achieve but if you put negative things out there then that's what will come to you. So if you put positive, you get positive. If you put negative, you get negative. So that's kind of how I look at life right now. And that's what I say. Like, I want 10, 000, 10 million subscribers. <laughs> that's my goal. Um, What are your goals when it comes to YouTube? Any advice for new YouTubers? Well, I'm a new YouTuber, so... 
I don't think my advice will be worth anything but I would say never give up and push through sometimes I feel like everything is against me and nothing wants me to make a video but at the same time like for example there's sometimes when I can't find my memory card and sometimes when I can't find my battery charger there's sometimes when my ring light don't want to work there's sometimes when all my batteries are dead there's some like there's always something every time I I'm ready to film and I always feel like maybe the universe doesn't want me to film but I'm always persistent if I don't get to film today I'm gonna film tomorrow and now what my cousin has also taught me is um, someone who isn't prepared is prepared for failure or something along those lines like you always have to be prepared what did he what did he say he said something about not being prepared but is prepared for failure can't remember the exact words but when he said that I was like yes like I needed to hear that but now I'm always gonna be on top of stuff because I do not want to fail I want to accomplish but yeah that's my advice always be prepared and push yourself to the max push yourself to the maximum potential you can you know you can do it so you will do it okay thank you guys for watching my channel bye guys if you guys like this video and want to see more or if you have a suggestion or something that you would like to see me do Please give this video a thumbs up and also like and subscribe to my channel. I know I'm acting like a bobblehead like...